Now, the last time we spoke was several months ago, and we talked about Afghanistan. And at that time, the Taliban had decided that little girls couldn't go to school. Obviously, the situation for women has worsened significantly. Just last week, they murdered an MP. They shot her dead in her home. What are you doing to help that situation? Well, actually, first of all, monitoring the situation and all the measures and the decisions that have been uh, taken by Taliban, it's, it's very frustrating and disappointing from our point of view. We've been trying to reach out to them in order to understand what are the uh, rationale behind the, these decisions because we cannot see it rationalized from a religious perspective or even from a cultural perspective. Because but you can't be surprised. We are not surprised, but we've been actually uh, talking to them and engaging with them, and especially the people that we've been engaging with them. They've been showing uh, a moderate reactions to our engagement, but it has not been demonstrated on the ground. So we don't understand what are the motives of, of such a decisions. It's just more and more provoking and making the situation much worse for them and for the Afghan people. We've been trying to uh, reach out recently after, uh, after this decision taking place. We've been trying also through uh, other means, with other, jointly with other Muslim countries, uh, to talk to them and to go together there. We are now in, in, in a consultation with other Muslim countries in order to find a plan at least to deal with uh, such a situation. Because we believe, uh, especially when it comes to the socioeconomic uh, issues that relate to Afghanistan, the region needs to play uh, more active role in, in, in that front. And I think that we, we would be like the best countries that can talk to them and at least can stop them or can help in reversing such a decision. So you don't regret your role as a mediator with the Taliban? Well, uh, we will never regret uh, to be a mediator or to help to facilitate talks because all the problems we have been seeing around us, at the end of the day, they need someone to talk to all parties and in order to get to a solution. What would be the alternative for a situation in Afghanistan? Is, the, is that going to be a civil war? This is not, not a solution. We would like to see a solution that can come through dialogue, through an understanding, addressing uh, concerns of all parties, and making sure that every, everyone in, in, in Afghanistan enjoy his rights, especially women. Yeah. Women in Afghanistan feel, no doubt, totally abandoned. What is your message to them? Our message to them actually is to they will prevail as they've been prevailing before. Uh, we will stand with them, we will support them, we will, not, we will not exert any effort in order to make sure that we are helpful for them and to make sure that these kind of decisions are not happening.